Hey y'all, uh, how's it going? It's your boy Kanar Lewis. We in the flesh. We doing it right. And I'm here today to talk about a topic that I definitely want us to hone in on as we are in the last video of 2019. I want us to carry that energy into 2020. I know you're looking at me like, oh snap with the curls, right? Yes, I got the man, but I know. I figured let me bring it out real quick. I'm about to get the little chop because my split ends, so I may not be able to wear the man bun for a little bit, but I'll get it back. That's all the kind of conversation. The real topic that I want to talk about is about humility. You know, being humble. I know you heard that topic before, you know, or you've heard it around. You know, even Kendrick Lamar said it be like be humble. But I think it's a very important character trait to develop because it it summarizes us as individuals that we that we're not gods, that we don't have it all, and that we're not the greatest human beings, and because we're not, you know, I, I'm not. To, it's, it's like it's not to say that you're not powerful, that you don't have value, because I know you do, but there's a difference between confidence and arrogance. Total difference, and the difference. It's basically around how you view and express yourself. You know, saying that you cute, hey, you know, like I'm cute, I'm handsome, to saying I'm the hottest person alive, you know, or I'm smart, you know, I got something to offer to, I'm the smartest room, you know. Granted, some of these things might be true. You might, in some cases, might be the smartest person in a particular room. But do you need to say that? No. You might be the hottest person in a room, but do you need to say that? You know, we have to understand that just because we have skills, just because we have things to offer, it does not mean that we can't gain things from other people. And that's where that pride and that arrogance comes in. I don't like it. It's good to be grateful for what you have, but we should not be overrating ourselves. We shouldn't. Because then, what? why? Why are we doing that? No, I, I get it. You know, we get we, we get confident, I, and I, I and I understand that where 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 that comes from because shoot, you know, you live a life where you would have anything, and then you start to have anything, and then it gets to your brain like I'm living a different world. I'm in a new self, so you have to adjust, and that's what's very important is about adjusting to you know the acquisition of these new skills. Right and like uh, like uh, like acquiring these new skills, because when you acquire new skills and you and, and you start leveling up, you are going to pass other people, but does that mean that you're better than them? No. Does it mean that you're smarter than them? No. Because we have to what what are we measuring intelligence by? You know what are we measuring status by? You know. Even like even even as a CEO, still gotta humble yourself. Even as a teacher, still gotta humble yourself. You know, there's a lot of people that navigate in this life thinking that they're the shit. Excuse my language, but that's how some of us move sometimes. And I and I and I get it. You have something to offer, but at the same time, you, we're not gods. We don't have all the answers. So it's okay to ask somebody with a, a lesser position than us or who has, you know, less educational credentials than us for help. Doesn't mean that we're unworthy or less worthy or less strong by asking for help. And that's another thing about being humble. You know, we have to understand that when we get into 2020 and we're leveling up, it's okay to ask for help. Because that pride, I know we talked about it before, right? Right, that pride and account, that pride and accountability with ourselves. We can't be so prideful and arrogant that we got all the answers, that we know what to do. Because we don't. We have to give credit when credit is due. We we ain't make it here by ourselves. So why are we acting like we got here by ourselves? You know, there were people put in place, and you could look at it as God, your parents, your role models, whatever you want to call it. We did not get here by ourselves. And we have to understand that we're still learning. We're still growing. You know, and, and, and it's about being nice and kind. When you're arrogant and you're obnoxious about it, 
you you actually put, rub people the wrong way. And I know because when I started getting confident, I did rub people the wrong way. So I had to develop this this new character trait and it developed me as a human being to be to to be more humble, to be nice, to take the load off my back, to un, un, to understand that yeah, I might be smarter than some people in some aspects, but doesn't mean that I'm better. I'm still growing. I even even as a speaker, I don't have all the answers. I'm still learning from other speakers. I'm still learning from other people. You know, it's okay to swallow that pride. Swallow it. Let it go down. Because in order for you truly to level up, in order for you to truly understand and to develop, you have to understand you cannot do it by yourself. You got to be humble. You got to be nice. You got to. You know, and I and I and I say that because it goes a long way. You know, it's okay to look at yourself as like I'm handsome, I'm cute, I'm smart, I got a lot of power. That's great. I think you should acknowledge your power and your value. Don't forget it. But when you start overrating yourself and start, you know, saying that you're the best person out there, there's always somebody that's going to be better. And we could always learn. We could always grow. But it's about moving in ways where we're not offending people. We're not rubbing people the wrong way. And we're not being ob obnoxious and arrogant. And we're not throwing that out there. Because I feel like the more that we do that, the more that we actually express this sense of insecurity that we shouldn't have. Because we have the skills, right? So why are we being in insecure about it? But... Let's try to be more humble. Let's try to ask for help more. And let's start off the years moving up, leveling up, you know, and just trying to be the best, the the best us that we can possibly possibly be. So thank you. And I'll see you next time.